Hello friends, good evening, good afternoon, and good morning, depending on wherever you are watching me from. I want to sincerely thank you for coming. Thank you for the love and support you give on this channel. I do not take it for granted. Thank you and welcome. In today's video, this a uh, uh, a video that to back up the last video I put out as per the Super Falcon scam and the number of players you know that are in car as of now. I'm happy to inform you that uh, the 20 I mean 20 players are already in camp. And so the camp is bubbling, the camp is lively. But before I go into it detail, please, if you are here for the first time and you are yet to subscribe to the channel, please consider subscribing to this channel and the press notification bell so that you are notified each time I post new videos. Okay? And also help and share the video if it is possible for you to do. I will appreciate it greatly. Uh, to my friends out there, thank you very much. My subscribers, the new and the returning one, you are the best. I appreciate the love and support. Thank you so very much. Guys, let's go straight into the gist. Paris 2024, Super Falcons camp is bubbling with 20 players. The arrivals of forward with China Kanu, Chiwindu Iesu at the Super Falcons camp in Severa, Spain. Um, uh, on Thursday afternoon, which is this afternoon, brought the number of players in camp to 20, with only defender Uluatos in the main and forward uh, Chino Jerem McLean still expected as the, as the African champion, Super Falcons, intensify preparations for their return to the Women Olympic Football Tournament after 16 years' absence. The two players are reported are scheduled to arrive at the team's hotel, uh, Basil, uh, Basilo Mutins Castillo, and resort on Friday afternoon. A full come by Friday means coach Randy Wardrum and his assistant will have five whole days to work with the entire playing body as well as the alternates ahead of Wednesday's uh, training match with Rainy Olympic Champions Canada. Team captain Rashid Ajibade was among the first arrivals alongside goalkeeper Shamata Nagose, Uchuku Lui, defender Chindima, Chindima Okeke and Nico Payne, Mifidas Christi Uchebe, Tony Payne, Deborah Biodo and Jennifer Ichegini, and forward Esther Ukurunko, two alternates Goalkeeper Morufa Demola and forward Give Monday were also early arrivals. The Super Falcons we are we fly into France on Thursday, the 18th of July, exactly a week to their tournament opening match against the illustrious opponent Brazil at the State Bordeaux. There are two other games in the group phase against Spain and Japan. In that order, we take place at the State de la Bujo in Nantes. Guys, the everything is taking shape as far as Super Falcon, Falcons camp is concerned, and uh, no stone is being left unturned to make sure that uh, the Nigerian ladies, you know, perform excellently in this year Olympics coming up uh, later this month in France. Well. After they been there for the, the last time they were there is 16 years, 16 years ago, and they want to make up for the time loss. I'm sure that uh, they are all ready, you know, to to show their worth and to prove that they have what it takes to win a medal football defense as far as female is concerned. Guys, what do you think about uh, you know the bubbly situation in the camp? The 2020 players are there are now in camp in preparation for the tournament, and uh, they are all in high spirit, you know, putting together 
you know, tactics, working out for formulas and uh, how they'll be able to, you know, deliver well when the tournament keeps off. And don't forget, as I said to you earlier on, they, they will be playing a friendly match, you know, as a preparation next week, Wednesday, you know, uh, to put them in proper shape. The following day, they will be flying straight to France. Guys, what are your takes? What are your opinions about the Super Falcons preparation? Do you think they are doing everything possible? Do you think they are in good hands? And do you think they are capable of getting out of their group and uh, go on to win, to get to the podium, you know, and fly the Nigerian flag? That would be awesome if they are capable of doing it. But don't forget, mouth does not play football. You know, it is set on the football pitch. So it depends on the tacticians, the tactics that the coach apply that win matches for teams. All right, let me know what you think. I'll be so glad to know what your, your opinions are. Thank you very much. If you have watched me to this moment, thank you very much. I appreciate the love and support. You are the best. And if you have not subscribed, please consider to subscribe to the channel. If you think it's a channel you can relate with, I will so much, so much appreciate it. All right. That's all about I have to share with you at this moment. Guys, take good care of yourself and I see you very soon. Bye-bye.